Well, following the Tyson plant fire a few weeks ago in Kansas, losses continue to grow for feed yards and the spreads between feeder losses and packer profits continues to widen. In fact, according to a recent Sterling Beef Profit Tracker, feed yard margins are now around a negative $203 per head, while packer margins remain at an historic $415 per head. And because of this, cattle industry leaders like Joe Goggins of Billings are launching a Twitter campaign today to help grab the attention of President Trump to help save rural America. I don't think it's a bad idea to let him know, try to let him know at least, that rural America, I mean, the people that helped put him in, now we're hurt. We need to get the word to somebody to look into this thing, to at least start a conversation, to try to get us some market share back. Because uh, the way it's going right now, there's, there's going to be a lot less of us. And Joe says it's critical, though, that when participating in the campaign to include the hashtag Fair Cattle Markets, and to also tag President Trump using his official Twitter handle at Real Donald Trump. Of course, for more information, you can also just reach out to the Western Ag Reporter office in Billings or visit them online at westernagreporter.com.